Welcome to Abhir and the study in Presidency School in Hello and here is my certification video for Google Sheets beginner. So the pro topic was about library management system. So here is my project. Calculate the total number, to sorry, student number, student names, class, book ID, book name, category, rent per day, date issued, total number of dates number of days and total amount we had to create a google sheet with the for this with this information and i've created one here calculate the total total amount by multiplying the rent per day into number of days so the total amount i have put multiply g g4 which is which is the rent per day and then i4 which is the total number of days and for the two validation use days cannot be negative or zero so total days see like i put a formula for this days today and comma h6 which is nothing but this but then let let me overwrite it and write minus two so there is a mark here invalid it the input must be greater than one so let's just undo it category of books could be can be na fiction non-fiction science computer and fun learning i've added some extra journals like uh, autobiography and fantasy okay so let me show you how i did this First, I merged the uh, first 10 columns, first 10 columns and the uh, first two rows. And then I gave it a uh, background color. And then I wrote library management. And then I I, I wrote the store, all this and then I gave it a purple color background and white color font, uh, font color. And then I gave all this information. And I added a filter here. I added a filter here. If I don't want to sell, if I don't want Priya, that particular entire row gets is not there. And I don't want Anuch, it's not there. Okay, so let's add them back. And then I've sorted here from A to Z. I can sort here from Z to A. I can clear. And then I have done conditional formatting here. Here in data, sorry, format, conditional formatting. Yeah, format conditional formatting i've added three rules its value greater than 350 in blue color which is greater than 250 yellow color and it's greater than 150 then it would be red color okay features we have to use formatting i've done formatting in many places here Merging cells, I have done merging cells here. Calculation with basic formulas, I have done calculation here and here. Data validation, I have done data validation here. Here, data validation. Conditional formatting, I have done conditional formatting here in this. Sorting, I have sorted here from A to Z. And then filtering, I have added filter here. Okay, so thank you.